Oh, this will work too. This will work. Trampa. This will work. This this is a good time to GX then. Or I yeah, there's no way to switch in. This has to be it. I was like, I can flip you up, but I heal it, and it, it negates the effect of this. So I don't want to do that. Go. Random Coco. Come in with the rainbow energy. Do we want to flip it right now? We get nothing. Let's GX. 300 damage. Hello, Nobles and the Frenchals. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. Hey, on all day's menu. I'll be serving you Drampa GX. Yeah, this is one of these cards that you gotta watch out for because it has very good base damage on its main attack. It's very close to Buzzwall, but being a basic colorless, you can squeeze a lot of tech in it. In fact, if something that exists or comes wrong in the future expansion, just suddenly might click with this deck. You gotta be careful. So, all right, so we we gotta experiment here. Now, the reason I got back to Drampa that you're seeing this video was uh, one of the stream rewards is that you can make me play any deck you want. Yeah, so uh, someone saved up for it. It is a Tashi, and he had a basic Drampa Coco deck. This was his original deck. Or he tried to use hmm, energy discard. Is that the thing you need? The little edge? We tried it out the exact way it was. You're gonna see that in the third match. And I felt, no. Oh, after trying it myself, it could have potential, but it's not enough. So, what do you need? We type it in now. Here's my British deck, which. Oh, we got some. You'll see. We got some excellent matches coming. You're gonna miss half. You miss uh, the first. Well. Don't miss the matches. Don't miss the matches. So, what's special about this deck? We're gonna do bench damage. Yeah, bench damage, weakening your opponent just so that Trampa and Tapu Koko will finish them off. So let's see if this works. I want to explain to you uh, a little bit more detail the the text, and you're gonna see it in three. Don't miss the matches. They're awesome, awesome. Three awesome matches. So let's get started. Today's intro. You know it. You know it by now. It is a certain character's theme from the game Chrono Trigger. The game of the day. We're still waiting for the sequel. No matter, no matter how long it takes. <laughs> so, anyways, let's uh, let's get the let's, it's old timer song. Let's get this started. Drop a GX. Let's talk about you. All right. Like I said, it's one of these cards, you keep watching it because of its high base damage. Just go right away. Berserk, if one of your bench Pokemon is weakened, any damage on it, it has a very high base damage. 150. You know what? It, that's without a choice, man. That's 180 now. And Buzzwell's like, wow, this guy can almost keep up with me. Unfortunately, Buzzwell has 10 more damage. It's not able to cable if only had a little more. And then, you know, the whole world would change. Oh, still, still, we're still looking for the right tech. And one of them, a uh, good old one, is Tapu Koko. Yeah. What's he do? Flying flip 20 damage to all your enemies. Now, once that 20 damage is there, this number starts to get dangerous. Now it's at 200. And then the problem is, oh, only I did 10 more damage again. So we're going to do something a little bit more intensive. Potal. This has actually been used uh, quite a bit, so... As long as the stadium buff, if your opponent evolves, they take 3 damage. You will not be doing any evolutions at all. It will not affect you, but it does for your opponent. You will see 30 means everything. 30 is what he wants. That is the exact number he needs to get a KO. So the Potown is going to be the best way. Coco, he needs about 2 attacks. 2 is a little too long. We won 1, so we're going to try to pop a GX. Now, one of our GXs can do that. Black Ray. All GX Pokemons, the highest HP Pokemons, will take 100 damage. Wait a minute, that means you only 80 hit points left. 
pretty much anything you got will one shot it at that point. So, hey, it's colorless. It could definitely fit here. And it could be the damage you know, it needs. So we tossed that in there. What else? We want to stick with Satoshi's lightning variant. So if, as long as there are three energies, three lightning energies, you can play Tapu Koko. Grab energies anywhere from your other Pokemon. Because they're wounded. They're hurt. Which, hey, that, that, you know, they'll hurt. The condition's good. So you send in a fresh Tapu Koko, you have a good chunk of damage. This is two shots. It doesn't need any help at all. And you also have the alternative GX, Tapu Thunder. If your opponent has lots of energies on their Pokemons, you can do a big one-shot KO. Big. And it kind of pressures your opponent to say, oh, I better not attach more than four energies. Because four is when you're looking for a kill now. Yeah, so three with all the bench damage might work too. All right, so any special attacks here. We're using a bunch of scoop ups. That's healing, that works with the Cocos, and uh, it's free retreat. It's an awesome, amazing card. Uh, circuitry! Hey, basic, throw them in. If your opponent's using double colors energy, like we are, it could really mess things up. Strong energy. It's nice to have these against buzz walls because they use lots of special energy. So, anything else? Oh, we're using, uh, instead of energy removal, we'll try to speed energies on ourselves. Max elixirs. Yeah, one of the fastest ways to get energies, and best ways, and it works so well with Coco. Because you can just arrow trail, grab them all up, no matter where they are. So, I think that's about it. You're like, why is the rainbow energy there? It's just a nice, easy way to hurt your own Pokemon. Huh? Yeah, yeah, he wants one of your Pokemon to be hurt. And doing this without one of the, uh, you know, throwaway evolution Pokemon kind of hurt. So, alright, so I think that's all the Cortex I have. My draw supporters, my deck thinners, my retreat, that's all balanced out. So, like I said before, you're going to miss out on some nice matches if, well, you decide to make sure you get them. Make sure you get them. So let's get started. Tapu Koko circuitry match. So we're doing a basic. What's this here? Ooh, Salazzle. Okay. Yes, please play Bridget. Please play Bridget. Please play Bridget. Fill up your bench. Fill up your bench so I can fry it. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Uh, let's get started. Welcome to another uh, circuitry match. Uh, uh, actually, it's a Coco with circuitry with all those there. That's not a Bridget. Uh, I'm gonna play my remix of this. Is I like uh, the number eleven is the clue for this. The eleventh Doctor's theme of Doctor Who. I'm just gonna tell you what it is this time. Na -na. Na -na -na. Yep, fill up your bench. More, more, oh! Okay, that's too many energies in your hand, Donald. We're gonna end this. We're gonna end this here. All right, you got Banana Masters. You don't really, I don't, you know I can thin and get pulled with Banana Masters. More of these? Sure. Energies to discard hurts. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna keep one energy for next turn. Let's see, that, let's, that may or may not be a deck that uh, one. Let's see, let's get a Drumpa out. That has a lot of firepower. The most firepower I have. And Banana Master, we're gonna pull. I didn't wanna lose two energy, so I had to toss a Float Stone. So let's see. Wow. Wow. Oh. Thanks, Banana Master. Fly and flip. Watcha! Unfortunately, if he does evolve with energy, I would lose that card. So, yeah. Max Elixir goes to Tauros. So I was like, yes, hurt me some more. I'm gonna pop your G my GX. So, not too much. Uh, we can do this one more time safely, I think. Two energies will actually go into this. He can retreat and start fighting too. So I gotta make sure, let's see, 160 damage. I can KO that. All right, two energies here. He evolves, oh wow, that was a double max elixir. That's not good. That means this is gone already. Lame. That means I have to send out, let's see, Banana Master. You can't take Banana Master out. All right, I'm a little desperate now. I'm desperate, but I don't want to kill all my draw supporters with three, so I have to do this. It's got no basic so far. I'll toss this down. Double Banana Master. Pal Pad, let's do it. I'm thinning. Thin, I'm, I'm, I really need a Max Elixir next turn. Then I can Coco in. Please, please, please. No! I got more. 
I got more. Hang on. No, banana. Okay, you can have this. Still got a chance. Banana Master should live. I wouldn't send another Coco out to give him another prize card for free. That's, you know, the power of going first there. So, here we go. Mmm, Zerua. Bye, zombie. Zombie really wants me to do this remix. Okay. Okay. Zorark is out. Potown taps it. Everything's wounded just a bit for Drampa to be very happy, but I need a wounded Pokemon first. And then I can go to town here. Actually, a DC and switching Banana Master to DC would be best right now. Let's see, I've used up a float stone, so. Mmm, keep blast. I'm alive. I wanna get you home, buddy. I need a DC though. Let's see. Let's see what we get. Throw away that. See if we can get DCE. We got a Coco. This will work too. This will work. Trampa. This will work. This this is a good time to GX then. Or. I yeah, there's no way to switch in. This has to be it. I was like, I can flip you up, but I heal it, and it, it negates the effect of this. So I don't want to do that. Go. Random Coco. Come in with the rainbow energy. Do we want to flip it right now? We get nothing. Let's GX. 300 damage. Get that, uh, get that there. Super odd, Cynthia. Yeah, I did discard. Yeah, it's worth it to get those cards back. All right, Tauros comes out. It's actually if I get a choice, man, I'd be able to KO this normally because the Pope already here, so that's good. And he's these guys need very few energies to go off, so it's a uh, it's a dangerous here. Okay, so can we get the choice, man? Maybe. Let's see what Cynthia has to say for that. Or I could just. Close stone off away or something. All right, you could attach it to another Pokemon. Yeah, that is true. That is true. I could have got to Banana Master because a Rainbow Energy is a Lightning Energy. It doesn't say basic. And my my brain was wired to say it was basic. All right, there's a the little poke there. Let's do this. Why are you doing this, Donald? See if it worked? It didn't? Okay, we need a choice ban. We also can go for the bench line, too. But I need an energy. I need an energy to keep momentum. And if I attack it, I die, so... Here we go. Cynthia. Best strong supporter I have. If it pulls me a choice ban, I get a KO. <gasps> and an energy. Thank you, Cynthia. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You got me two prize cards with that lucky, lucky draw. Thank you, thank you, Cynthia. Thank you. And I got another choice, man. Thank you, thank you, prize card. Thank you, everything. And we got a, we got, if this Max Elixir goes through, he's gonna be pretty powerful 180. And the poke from the Poe Town and the poke from the Coco at the start makes, uh, makes it a little helpful for these guys here. In fact, I could probably Guzma that out there if this works. Evil Soda is like, I'm ready to deal with you. Guzma Lele for game. Well, I need DCE, and I need this to work. Alright, so if this works, I win. And if it doesn't end my hand or something right there. Heat Blast? Okay. Okay. This is game if this works. Okay? Game. Top deck. Top deck. Top deck, top deck, top decks. Top decks. You rock, Mr. 11th Doctor. If you want, if you want, if you want to win all your games, just play this remix and, you know, his vibe. It's because, I, you know, I said all this nice stuff about the Doctor at the start of his stream. Yeah? Yeah. It's like, Donald, I got you. 
I got you. I'm gonna get my TARDIS, and I'm gonna make sure that you have all the cards you need when you want them. This one game. Thanks, Doctor Who. Okay, moving on. Moving on there. Moving on. Welcome to another uh, Tapu Koko match. Yeah. Today's, I suppose, winner. Yep. You redeemed the reward where you want to play me, you will play me. Alexander did that, so... And he's the last boss of the stream. Here we go. Let's get started. What do we have here? I have a free retreat Coco. Nice. And I also have a Drampa. Hmm. Now you have to choose. Do you want to go for bench damage? Or do you want to make sure this is, you know, ready? We'll see here. This always helps. Let's put this on here. All right. So let's get some music up. So I need an intense music for this. And we're going to use a new one that is a final boss theme of... Ooh. I'm going to give you the hint. One of the main characters is Stock. Stock Holmes of this RPG on the DS. I think that's a big enough hint toward where this game is from. Very, very big. You gave a name for that, so... Mm. And the name of the title of this song is really nice, too. That's a lot of cards in your hand there. Let's go play Ed and not Cynthia, because I can shrink it by one. Just one. And what do we have here? Poe Town. If this stays in effect, it will hurt him. But there's no risk to throwing this out, so we do that. We throw Banana Master out. We may or may not need another Trompa. I got room. It's fine. This is for thinning purposes. It's okay. It's okay. Got another DC for the next Trompa, too. So we need a, may need a Rainbow Energy in a bit, so I'll toss it down. I may end up regretting it, but, uh, there. Sad face. I'll do a heartbreak. Professor Kukui as your draw supporter at turn one. That's a lot of cards, but if you... Maybe, maybe the end really ruined him. I don't have another one for you, uh, Alexander JM, but... Yep. And... The ball is rolling for me. The ball is really rolling for me. DCE rams me. Okay, so if I play with Cynthia... I have a Max Elixir. If this kicks in, that doesn't kick in. I would say I would have won the game, but I didn't. So, we can't get a KO. If we retreat, send this out, I'm already wounded, so that's good. We're gonna use Righteous Edge, take that DC off, because they're valuable. So, seven hands. That is bad luck. If that's nothing else. Seven cards in his hands now. Gonna replace that, so... Darkness and dragons do more damage. Hmm. What kind of deck is this? Is it a dragon? I don't know. I don't know, but if this... There's nothing else... That's game and we gotta redo this, so... Having on, hang on, not just yet. He evolved it. He's got Lele. It ain't over. It's not over, Bridget. The whole line comes down now. Let's see, how wounded is this? Not enough. And this will really intensify his damage from this here. Weevil, Sneasel. Okay. Zorark, Zorark. Hmm. Now this is looking more intimidating. Now if he's got DCE to attack now, it gonna hurt. I'm gonna lose half my life. And I won't be able to KO him back. That's gonna hurt. Right, is beating. Okay, what do we got to do with that? We definitely try to get one more hit in. Or we could Righteous Edge and get Plan B going. Why we want a Righteous Edge? Because he's got to be running low on DCEs, right? Make him uh, do that. And then this guy will be able to get to the KO for sure. Yeah. If I get the DCE here. Let's do that. Let's play this here. Cynthia, because I don't want to discard all my draws. I'm going to get stuck in the middle of the game because I have no draw supporters. Hmm, good. This works. This is guaranteed to attack. Bingo. Bingo. Okay. Any reason I should flip? I can't send Coco in now. So we're gonna do Righteous Edge. Poke that DC away. Weaken it up, now it's 140, 
right? So now this guy's like, hey, I don't need my berserk. But yeah, you do. Stay here. Do not die. All right, evolve. Flow is coming. Flow is coming for him. He's catching up. He's get. He has a lot of card pulls here. I really kind of do want to give this Coco up right now. Yeah, I want to give this Coco up so I can uh, do damage. Hmm. Although if I lose this, my damage will go down here. So, Zora Arc Two. We knocked off two DCs. You can recycle that with a, uh, you know, something else there. So, all right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Reshuffle with Mallow. Oh, Mallow. He can line up any two cards you want, which is gonna be a DCE. He's gonna have a DCE to fight. There we go. So that's gonna be three DCs. And he may have some way to recycle those DCEs as well. Puzzles of Time. Ooh, that's a good way to get them back out. Mallow gets both those DCs out. Mmm. So, yeah. Let me see what I, I can do. Oh, man. It's not looking too good. Although we're trading evenly, I guess, I suppose. Yeah, I really w wish I had a Poe Town or a De-Evolution and I could do the combo. Like, it, he has to attack twice right now. Coco isn't... S Wait a minute, where's my circuitry? Hey, circuitry, do you have any dark energies here? I'm sure he does, I'm sure he does, so... This is gonna be a problem if he copies, if he gets, uh, yeah, this guy up, so... Let's see, big Zora arc. I kinda really wanna take this out here, big time. Let's see. What happens here? He doesn't want to give that up. He'll trade that up. Okay. I'm more afraid of that card, because if that GX card comes in, I'm in trouble. We'll do this here. Alright, we need a Boa Pokemon to fight right now. I have to do this. I need a bigger hand. I don't think circuitry will stop him because he's got regular energies and stuff. Maybe this card might really put a dent in his uh, GXs. What if I take out the circuitry? What does he have to fight me with that? He probably has regular dark energies, right? Let's do this. Let's get you charged up. How many max elixirs I got left? Two? We're not gonna be greedy. We're just gonna get two right here. Alright, yeah, elixirs, extra energies. Coco's not Coco is good for the healing, but that's about that. I gotta be careful with my bench space. Let's go ahead and use Berserk. Take that out. At least the break is not gonna uh, come out to get me. I'm I'm definitely afraid of break. Yeah, that's good. And I can hurt a lot of Pokemons here. So, let's see what comes out though. A fresh one comes out. All right, I know he's got DCs in his hands. I can Guzma for the KO and that is probably what I need to do. And I'll probably need to switch my energies out too with this because I don't want to give this up a two more prize card. He'll be too close to winning. Ah, I don't do enough damage to take that out. That's lame. Hmm. 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 Let me see what I can do. Hmm. This is a little... There we go. He's got the big... We He's got this Weevil out. I can one-shot that. I'm taking uh, taking uh, my float soon away. How many abilities do I have? Two. I have two abilities, so this does a hundred. This does half my life. I don't think he's gonna retreat just yet. I think he's gonna fight me with this right here. Okay. Let's see what we got. If we GX, or I don't, know, I don't think I should save the juice. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is going to be a battle of attrition. I don't have 140 damage. Yeah, I do. 
Yeah, I can use my that and finish it off with this card. I do. I do have enough. I do have enough. Shiny Ultra Ball! And Coco is going to be able to get that KO too, so... Alright, I think I know what I need to do next. I can't... Uh, yeah. Yeah. I, I know what to do. I got this. Get a Zora Arc out. Alrighty then. You're done. You're done, buddy. You did a good job. He's going to pull the Coco out to... Ooh, kill my damage. Luckily, I'm still okay with this. So he's got another prize card. Yikes. Fortunately, I'm holding uh, the stuff I need. Coco, come in. Take those energies off. No, don't take it off the uh, the circuitry. I'm sorry, the the Krasma. This is a kind of a threat. I don't. I'm not gonna get rid of this. Get the Drumpa ready to fight. I can't play Professor Sycamore. Let's deal with the threat. We could get two prize cards right now, can't we? Not anymore. You could Guzma. Not anymore. You you, uh, you you already made that that too. Lily for one though. Yeah, yeah, or two. Don't Nana Master sounds a little too much. But he might block for me for a bit, just a little bit. Yeah. Okay, circuitry. You can get the both. Take the board. Let's Lily for one. Pow pad. Great. Yeah, let's go up, drop the pal pads in. All right, so, yeah, I want to be pulling Cynthia's. Super odd. Emergency Lele for the future. Yeah, whenever you, all of you guys come back. Here we go, Sky High Claw, take that out. Take a prize card, we're now even in prize card. No, we're not, we're not. He's still ahead for taking up my other Pokemons. That's very good. That's very, very good. Fresh Coco comes out. Alrighty then. I don't want to lose these. I used up my pal pad, man. If I play Professor Sycamore, I'm going to have a hard time winning the game because I can't Guzma. So we'll have to see what happens here. We'll have to see what happens. Our bench is getting full, so I'm kind of scared of a big... The baby Zoar. That hurts a lot. Especially with a choice, man. Alright, we need two more prize cards. Can we do it? I see one right here. I might be able to get another one somehow. This is scary. This is scary. This is intense. He's looking for DCEs, unless he spent them somewhere. I know, was, I know he recycled them back, but now there are two more there, so... I don't know what's up, but well, we'll see. We'll see. He's definitely got a two-hit for me. His damage is 80 with a double colors energy. I scared him, like, I got a circuitry. Yeah, so... The circuitry may be able to do something here. Okay. What are you gonna do? I'm expecting him to hit me. It's gonna be the big one. They're all rainbowy. You can't really tell what everything is. And he threw away the little one. The little one's more scary. That means the circuitry could be useful if I do max elixir. But I think I spent a bunch. Yeah. You only got one max elixir somewhere. That's your bonus energy, so. Okay. We got. I know he wants DC. Is he? Does he want to do something else too? No. Yeah. There it is. There's DC. Right is beating. Half my life. Pull this here. We have a wounded wounded one of these. That's good. I can't have space for another Banana Master. And I need to save these Guzmos. There's another Coco. Perfect, perfect, perfect. What's gonna happen here? Take the energies off. Put it onto the fresh one. And this guy is activated. 
The Drumpa is now activated, so I can if I get another energy, I'm good to go for him. Oh, I don't have enough damage. I don't have enough damage. Great! You're missing by a little bit, but we might be able to do something for... We might be able to do that. One damage away? Great! Great! No! Well... We s well, we'll have to wait for wait for a bit. Nah, he's gonna have to need another energy or retreat this here too. Hmm. Hmm. I missed that blow it up. However, hmm, this GX might be able to do something if he doesn't have Acerola here. Ooh, yeah, those are some nice shiny Ultra Balls, man. Okay, so in that case, we, we probably should have just attacked it. Yeah, attack the front one. Because then I, I, I didn't need any damage on this, did I? Yeah, yeah, I did. It only had 70. It only had 70. So we'll see what we do can do here. Hopefully, I think I think I'll have to retreat. I'll put a sad face. Whatever he found isn't there. Whatever he needed isn't there. No retreat at the moment. No uh, Lele for Guzma. Is Lele even there? I don't see it, but... I mean, there's a lot of nice shiny cards here, so I don't, I don't know. That's so glowy, it's so gold, it's so rainbowy. Sneasel. All right, Sneasel comes down because there's no Lele for a retreat or something. Okay. What am I gonna do with this? I'll probably Cynthia for an energy. Mm, yeah. Or Al Guzma again. And try to win with this Necrozma GX. I don't have a retreat with that though, so mm, I can't, can't be uh That's not possible. Let's see what the next card is for. Likely I'm gonna play Cynthia. I need another energy. I'm giving up too many turns, so I have not been able to charge up my Pokemon right now. So let me get some water. Mmm. <laughs> Trading. Fishing. Don't need that Mew. And we need a Mew in our deck to get the uh, get, get get those buzz walls away, Ben. Articudo GX Cynthia. How, I think it's DC count there's two here, one here, there's only one left in his deck. Which is why, you know, he doesn't want to give this up for free. Or he's looking for Acerola. That was I don't know. I don't know. Let's get energies, guys. Let's get energies for momentum. My turn. So that goes. That's free for me. I could shrink his hand, but you know, you're not gonna stop a three Zorark. You got a flip for this thing. Nice. Got two removal. I don't think I need that just yet. I do need it on this gear, but no energies is big. You got a fix for that, Donald? I really wanted an energy. Really, really wanted an energy. Okay. There's nothing you can do about that. We'll save our hand. We'll Sky High Claw. We'll get our two prize cards. Destroy a stadium. Not... It's only 10 damage and it doesn't make that much of a difference. I'm waiting if he has a float stone or something. I'm saving it for a float stone or yeah, with his retreat. Gonna send out a sneasel because, oh, that, 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 that kills me. If he got it, that's gonna kill me, and I'm gonna be sad. I for, didn't see that. Uh oh. Uh oh. One, two, three, four, five, five abilities, one hit KO, one energy. Super crazy value. Crazy, crazy value. We don't have a way to get a one-shot... Yeah, we do. We have a one-shot kill. I need to shut up because, you know, somebody may be listening here. Can you see what I'm gonna do with my next hand? 
that he doesn't have this to evolve. Ouch. That must be the sad thing. We have a one hit. Be quiet. Be quiet. Can you see what I need to do with the next match? Let me see here. Can you see how I can. Oh! He ended away all my winning cards. Uh oh. He knows. He knows that. I had the winning uh, winning moves in my hand. He doesn't have that many cards left. Heartbreak for a Weevil Waste. Puzzle was my last two. Oh, yeah. I'll put the Heartbreak. Well, he ended away my winning move, so I tried to thin too. I got you. Oh. Yeah, well, that sucks. I'm sorry, man. 70 damage. Okay. Choice ban. Energy. Give me more cards. Lodestone. Potown. Potown. Thinning. Not risking this Coco to let it die. Send this out. Here we go, Berserk. I don't want him to get him too close to a victory. Make him, you know, there. But he's... I think he's out of gas. I think he is out of gas. I think he's at. So this comes out. This is 180 damage. I need a Guzma. The turn before, the reason I shut up was that I had Guzma, I had energy, I had a choice band. I was going to Guzma this out a couple turns ago before he ended the way. So that's why that was there. He's going to Guzma that out. And that's going to be game. This is I have Lele here. I have Lele here. So I'm going to put a hard face. There we go. GG. Throw these two here. Hang on. I recycled my Lele and let something happen to it. Lele, is Guzma here too? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I have a wounded, uh, wounded Coco on the bench right there. It's sitting out there. It's like, oh, I'm halfway dead. Guzma! Trumpa! Combo! Pulled. That's a Lele. <laughs> They're all rainbowy effects. And we won through because I suppose he missed the prize. He missed the prize because they got prized up with the, like he said, uh, puzzles of time. Couldn't get that Weevil to obliterate me. And then he would have goosebumped my bench down, so I see that. Good game. Good, 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 good game. Okay. Okay. That is that. Great, great, great match. All right, Satoshi. Hopefully the first real match of Satoshi's deck. This is the deck. The way it is, right off the bat, we're going to do no changes, and we just want to play to see, like, where this deck is. Experience it. You have to taste the flavor before you, you know, judge it or say anything about that. So, I'm going to play my remix of This Is from Xenoblade Chronicles, one of the fight songs. I don't give the name of that because it's hit hinting that it's not in Spotify till May yet. So, uh, yeah, here we go. I don't trust pulling another, uh, pulling something. I'm gonna deploy this immediately. I have another Coco, so that's okay. It's a bit wasteful because you, you want to save this, but if your hand gives you this, then you gotta play with that, so. Wait a minute. I saw that t t Knife Null, so if he's using a, he might maybe be using a DCE. Will a Lapras deck? I don't think so. I actually tried this deck. I didn't work so well because, uh, well, you know. That's for a different day. I'll answer the question. It didn't work so well because maybe I got really, really powerful opponents or uh, something there. So let's leave it be. Let's leave it be. All right. How was that for a first turn? Not bad. One energy. I'm using basics. I don't have to worry too. All basics. No evolution. So this is easy. Ooh, yeah. 
that's the deck we made, the uh, same deck we made some time ago. We ended up... I ended up using uh, something else other than this. I ended up using Glaceon. It worked out so much better against a much powerful, stronger decks. We could handle that much easier uh, against certain things, like uh, the Lissopod. But let's keep watching on the match. Here we go, Lapras. Collect three more cards. Pretty good for him. He wants Max Elixirs here. So do I. So do I. So, we got DCE here, but you don't need it. It does work with it, though. Let's throw a hammer out. See if we can take this away. Misses. That's okay. I don't want to lose the Guzma. I don't want to lose the DCE. I'd rather use it for a Pokemon that Drampa, that really needs it. There are 13 energies in this deck. I remember. So let's pull an energy and use that. There we go. I'm not ready to fight yet! The first hammer most busted. How about the second hammer? Second hammer is busted too. We need a warranty for these. I'm not ready to switch in yet. I'll hold these here. Let it be. Let it be. Might not be the time to use Plumeria. Yeah. Let's try to Wick Dex. Hi, Wick. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing? Wick could really shuffle his hand up. Or, I don't know. Wick is like the new Birch. Wick is like the new Birch. Remember Birch in the old days? Heads, does he love you? Does he love you? Does she love you? We're gonna find out soon, unless it's a really a good time to play Plumeria. So, uh, boom here. You can do Circuitry's GX. I could. I could. And he's got, uh-oh. I like this combo. I like it, but it hurts against the biggest meta decks, strongest meta decks a lot. So, it's like, you know what? I can charge up. He missed both of his hammers. I can fight you. Now we don't have an energy. We can get lucky with Banana Master too. He doesn't have a one shot on me either. Unless he has a choice ban. And if he does, that would be very, very bad. Or here the Ice Beam too. He's gonna protect it in the back right there. But he already used up his energy. He won't be able to get the extra draws here. So we might be okay. You might need you again. He also has the silver eye later to get energies back too. What are we gonna do here? We got the rainbow energy. He's got full retreat, free retreat for all his Pokemons. I know he's stuck. He didn't play a draw supporter. Let's play this in here. Let's switch in now. Plumeria. I'm gonna take away an energy away. Does it automatically. And because the banana master, they work so well together. Three bananas here. Another banana master. Another Drompa. He's mad. And I'm gonna pull two more bananas. Five bananas. Switches. Do I need to no the recycle thing isn't even up. Sky High Claw. Now he's got free retreat, so. We'll have to fish it out with Guzma later. Hopefully the Guzma... How many Guzmas is here? Let me check. Let me check. He got another energy on. There are two Guzmas here. Okay. Zombie! Has gifted herself to reading Hui. I never really... Wow. Well, oh, congratulations, uh, reading Hui. And thank you, Zombie, for uh, being generous. Okay, not to say that. And yeah, moving on here. He played Cynthia. Choice ban. One shot KOs me. Wow. That development's bad. Everything is a one shot KO to him. I lost all my energies. I think uh, we're out of this, guys. He can't at yeah, he can't attack. His whole crew is assembled. I don't have a one-shot anywhere. Okay, keep pulling. Keep going. Keep going. You might have something. Coco, everything goes back up. 
Banana Master, let's go. What you guys got for me? Bring me something good. Switch. Switch. Yeah, pull, pull. What do you got for me? Energy. I need elixirs. Flip! It's a one hit KO again. Dangerous. Dangerous. Very, very, very. Uh, if he gets another Pokemon ready, he's like, yep. If when he sw every time he switches and comes in, he found the drop that was gonna charge up with a Guzma to say that's another two prize card guns. And Lele's the next fighter. Blizzard Burn. Okay. Okay, Banana Masters, what you guys got for me? Okay, that's 160 now. Energy here. Banana Masters, maybe you guys got something for me? Both of y'all? A hammer? Three defective hammers! Hmm. Manufacturer warranty. Heartbreak. Yeah. I think he's. If he has a Guzma in his hand and a choice band, it looks like game. Three energies. Yeah. <laughs> Cynthia, so it's not game yet, but it's getting a. I don't think I can get back with six prize cards. I haven't taken a single prize card. He's got one more after this. Alright. He also had a choice band too. I have nothing to one-shot this. This is too high of a hit points. There's no firepower. Uh, there, I, I do, but I need more energies on the field. That's all I got. Take it away from this. Double Banana Masters. Here we go. He's got a Guzma that I'm, uh, I'm in trouble. Well, I've lost. Hey, the final hammer! It cannot be four tails. It can definitely not be... Break out calculator. Uh, four tails. Chances. Dang. I ain't got a Guzma. I've lost. Lapras, you finish that. Yeah, that's life, man. That's life. Well, I hope you enjoyed the matches. So, we're at the end. Thank you, congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. Let's break it down. Let me tell you how I feel about this. Here we go. Unique trait? What's the special deal about this? It's easy to set up. You get a lot of value for its attacks. Yeah, it's efficient. There we go. Efficient. Three energies. Three energies. Easy to get them all up. Very good value in each. Yeah, you have near one-shot KOs, which brings us to damage. It's a 
Meaning, yeah, other basics. Oh, buzz wall. Almost one shot chaos. It's just so close. But being a basic, yeah, you can't, you can't just give it a straight one shot that easy. Buzz wall. So it requires it's a you know, little bit extra of help. So this extra help isn't as fast though. It's not chain one shotting until you prepare and set up for it. So you know, that's how it's supposed to be. But it's base damage because it's so high. I'm gonna give it 4.5, near five. Maybe one day something shows up that can give that full five setup. Five out of five. There's no evolution. Any turn you want, it could show up. Any of these Pokemons can be instantly charged one turn. The reason is you have Max Elixir, you have DCE. Any single turn, if these are just in your hand. Oh, yeah, I got Pokemon right to fight. Kinda, kinda. He needs, you know, that the uh, awakened Pokemon, so that's pretty easy to get if it's just lying on your bench. Still, overall, the setup is a five. Five. Anything up, anytime. So, that's good. Defense! I Low HP, low HP, low HP. This is low? Yes. A lot of Pokemons one shots these easily, including the Drampa. There are much others that do it with a little bit 10 more damage, so it, it, it's gonna go. It's gonna die pretty quick, so you have to keep up with your firepower, which you will. You'll need a one turn charge. All right, so that uh, defense, it's its a three out of five. People have no trouble one shot you. You have to keep up with the firepower. Rating! It works enough. Lightning Drumpa works enough. I still think there's something else though. This is a nice speed tech. Does say that, but I feel like it needs more uh, reliable bench damage somewhere. I have, I think it would exist somewhere. Hang on, that. So we'll see Drumpa again soon because I have a lot of faith in it. It's just a so good bench damage, and because there's just so many options, we'll see you again in the future. But for now, we'll keep looking for the answer. This is not bad. But some other card can really make this deck click. We're gonna find, keep on looking. So, uh, let's see. Weakness is Dallas removal? I don't think so. I think that was last time's deck. So, weakness is this thing has low HP. And it just needs a little bit but more dench damage. Alright, so what do you have for us next time, Donald? We're gonna do. Ooh, let's see. I see two decks here. Which one am I gonna choose? You even plan this out? Let's do something a little bit more fancy and unique. Yeah. This is going to be the first deck I ever use this card. I think I've found a good combo. Using which elements? It's going to be these first two. Yeah. Something nasty. Something that can really shake the meta. Really? Well, let's just let's just keep it as nasty. Because if you're not prepared for this deck... And uh, I think I'm a step ahead of what, uh, what people will be trying to do. Mm, okay, we'll see about that. that was, okay, so that is it for today. Thank you on the gross of frontals. Please like, subscribe. It helps us a lot. And you know I got more good stuff coming for you. Uh, I stream live on Twitch. Those tend to happen at night. If you're in the loop, you're in the loop. Follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. My Discord link is right above my head. I'll let you know when I have to fight Ninja Monkeys on there. Uh, okay, so covers my cover. If you like what you hear, they're on iTunes, they're on Spotify, wherever you like to stream music. New ones are coming this May, so that is it for now. Thank you, Inner Girls, for Frenchels. Guys, take it easy, stay safe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.